Let's just skip all this intro junk. All right, here we go. So normally one of these eyeballs is supposed to be dead. Oh nice, it's a blue one. I just want everybody to know that this game got into a big 20 before Rockin' Cats did. Before Kickmaster did. I didn't even play um, this game in that bingo race. I tried it, and I'm like, this game sucks. So I didn't bother. All right. Oh yeah, you're right. Well, to be fair, people don't like Felix either, so. Before pac I don't know if that's a fair comparison. Pac-Man and Estyanax are two very different length goals. I, st I still get your point, though. Like I said, I think this game is better than Mickey Mouse Capade, at least. I do. Um... Oh, come on. But that's not saying a whole lot. I'm gonna have one less super going into the boss. And I couldn't even kill him. Yeah, Rockin' Cats is, as you said, amazing. Laggy NES games. Yeah, this game, I think this game lags more than Mega Man 3. But, it, I mean, here's the thing, I'll give credit where credit's due. I think this game does have some unique ideas. Like, upgrading your weapons, and it also forces you to use a certain amount of energy and power, like, it kind of keeps you, like, you have to kind of be thinking about that as you go. I do like that aspect about this game. Um, so yeah, there, there, there's some things worth celebrating when this, when it comes to this game, but, uh, the actual gameplay is not exactly one of them. There's also different magic spells you can use. I'm only going to be using two of them. I think the record uses all three of the spells, but I'm only going to be using two. Uh, fire and time stop. Yes, you can stop time. Okay. Yeah, I actually think the power... Yeah, for sure. Like, you have to kind of wait on your attacks to get more power out of them. You can't just mash, because then the power is going to stay low. Which I actually do like about this game. I think that kind of sets this apart from some other games. So, I think... I think there's some good ideas here, but I don't really... I'm not crazy about the execution. If I had to rank this in a tier list, I would put this in the poor tier. <clears throat> not worst of Ness, but poor. I forgot the strat already. Okay. 
Well, luckily it still worked out alright. The world record holder doesn't even get the sword until, uh, the final world. I get it earlier than that, as you can see. Oh, that was just an hour. Ah, um... I... This jump sucks. I don't really know how to deal with this. I've tried, I just do not know what to do here. So now I'm weaker, and this guy is just gonna block now. Yeah, if I see this game in the next Big 20, I'm gonna assume that the list was just rigged. If I see this game in. Same goes for Mickey Mouse Capade. That's how I'll know it's rigged, is if I see any of these garbage games. That's what you want to do, but I couldn't get another enemy to cooperate. That's fine. Oh yeah, this boss can also loop around to the other side of the screen if you keep hitting him. If, you, if you're doing well, he'll just loop around to the other side of the screen. Which was clearly intentional. Nice job, Jalico. Thanks for doing a good job making your game. I did not think he was going to spit three of those out immediately. Come on. Oh, by the way, the goal for this from the Big 20 it was in was beat the game. And this is like a 20 minute game. World, World Record gets a mid-15. Alright, time for time stops. I'm so happy I landed there. There we go. 
was hoping for health. Health? Thank you. another level where we're going to be using time stop quite a bit. Actually, 5-1 as well. 5-2, um, not really. We can if we want, but not really. I think we're going at a solid two frames per second. Great NES game. Look, as much as I love and appreciate the NES, this game is not one I appreciate that much. And this was licensed. If this was unlicensed, that's a whole different story. This was licensed. Nintendo looked at this and said, sure, this is fine. I did not think that would reach. I'm gonna have to. I don't really know a way to get through that without it. I actually forgot what boss it is coming up. None of these bosses are very memorable, unfortunately. That's something that I think would have helped the game, as if the bosses were better. Does that count as a hit? It does, sweet, okay. I have no special here. Oh, I should have actually, eh. I have a lot of health, which is gonna help. Um. Normally I don't have this much health, and normally I don't drop this many frames on stream, so that's nice. Worst case scenario, I'll put the recording up. Record your streams, everybody. Okay. Well, at least we got through it. <clears throat> Honestly, I if this game did get in another big 20, if it was like half the game or something, I'd probably be okay with it. Um, I would not be okay with full game of this. That would that would put me out of it. And full game Mickey Mouse Capade will also be a deal breaker for me. Forgot I was supposed to do this. I was supposed to fight that one. forgot that was there, but okay, we got through it. That one's easier to manage. I have more time stop than I need. Let's use one here. Oh, I 
probably shouldn't have done that. I don't know. I can't remember if there's another one of those before the boss or not. I forgot. You would suffer through TMNT again before having to race this? Oh, that's a good point. I don't know if this is worse or if TMNT is worse. I don't know. I know that's not the question, but... I don't know, I think TMNT is worse than this, honestly. At least I can find redeeming qualities about this game. I can't find anything redeeming about TMNT 1. I, I genuinely can't. I don't know why people voted that game in the list uh, for 13, for the Big 20. I don't know why people voted in TMNT 1. I, I really do not understand. I think it's because... I genuinely think a lot of the games that were voted in were only voted in just to screw with people. You disagree, and that's fine. I'm not saying I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying I would, I'd probably play this before I would play TMNT. Jump up there. Thank you. I think nostalgia, yeah. Also, Ariel. Most of the voters didn't even join the race. That, I think that's why Ninja Gaiden got a lot of votes, is because they just wanted to see people beat Ninja Gaiden. I think Little Samson is probably the same, because they're like, oh, then they're gonna have to, everyone's gonna have to buy a Little Samson cart, which, no. Um, I hope I remember the route through this level. I didn't write it down. Um, also, Chippendale 2. Not only did a few people like myself vote for it, but um, a ton of Russian speedrunners voted for Big 20 games, and I think almost all of them voted Chippendale 1 and 2. So I don't even know if- I don't even know if we can say Ariel's campaign worked. I mean it worked, but I don't even know if it was because of him. To be fair, I forgot how varied the ghost house RNG boss can actually be. I forgot how bad it is. Or how bad it was, so. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, I've already... <laughs> further proving it deserved to be in. I still want to see a Big 20 where they go to the bottom uh, of the list and only put in games that only got one vote. Even if it's been in already, it's like, a ga games that only got one vote. That would still- that would be a giant meme. But at the same time, that would also be- that would- that would be the worst Big 20 list. Forget 14, which I don't agree with anyways, but, yeah. 14 was definitely mediocre, though. I mean, I still enjoyed it. Like, I enjoyed it at the time, but if, I mean... If we took a year and a half off, and we came back to that list, I'd be like, okay... Oh, I made it, thank god. Well, we're not getting a sub-20. That wasn't really the goal. The goal was to get a time in this game. This godforsaken game. What? Okay. I can't remember if there's another bo- Yeah, there is. Okay. I couldn't remember if there was another one. I was supposed to time stop, I think. Or at least that was a choice. You don't have to, but I wanted to. Alright, I'm gonna have to take out the arm. Did 
To be fair, I have a ton of health. We might be all right. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. I don't know. I think I think if we knew Big Twenty was gonna continue after thirteen, because I didn't think it was going to. <clears throat> if we knew it was gonna continue, I would have waited until Big Twenty fourteen. Or at least it absolutely would have been in that list, is the point I'm trying to make. I can't remember if I need time stop for what's coming up or not. I don't remember. Oh, I hit his bullet. I didn't even hit him. There is a health refill in this area, but it's going to be a little bit before we reach it. The actual final boss is not difficult. You can still screw him up if you're not, if you're just being clueless, but yeah. We might have to play this one safe. Okay, I think there's only one more boss, but this one's one of the tougher ones, so. Yeah, okay. Hmm. That, that doesn't get any closer. Full health, let's go. Now I don't have any, uh... Oh no, it refilled, nice. Okay, I forgot it did that. Okay. One more boss and then it's over. That's all my magic. Almost there. Oh, but I forgot he has a time stop too. That's it, all right. <sighs> well, that was more enjoyable than Mickey Mouse Capade at least. I still don't really like this game that much, but... Oh, dude. Both games I did tonight, Infinite Mystery has better times in than I do. If I didn't die that in that one level, I would have been fine, but... Eh, whatever. Wow, I've dropped 5% of my frames tonight. Sweet.